behind are 55 percent. All six of the other candidates on stage together combined didn't beat you and DeSantis. That's pretty stunning. Well, I think the debate was really useful last night because it smokes out some real ideological differences in the GOP. And that's going to make bet. the party stronger. That's going to make the country stronger. And so I think that that was a successful evening. And, and the reality for me, Laura, is that even though we had some what it will call banter on the basketball court last night, I still view the other people on that stage as colleagues in our national revival. I expect to be the next president. I expect to win in a landslide. But I will require, respectfully, each of those people to play their respective roles in our national revival as well in some way. Because this is a team sport. And you brought this up earlier. It's not the job of the U.S. president to, to automatically bring back faith in the country. But I do think it's an important point to pause on where the left feeds our vacuum of purpose with race, gender, sexuality, climate. And I do think we as conservatives need to now level up. So oh, we're yeah. not just criticizing that agenda but offer an actual vision of our own, individual, family, nation, God. I'm leading the way on that, but I'm going to need the other people on that stage to play their part right, in our Vivek, revival, too. We, Vivek, we got to get, ba get back to the Trump chase here, but um, thank you for joining yes. us. All right, joining